Yeah, definitely there is a difference. Uh, at least for me, I found it myself being a part of the team of Interpol at GCI. Uh, so first of all, uh, previously we had kind of an ad hoc communication of private sector and a number of different uh, law enforcement agencies of different countries. And you know, every different private company would have a different network of partners uh, across the world. And that just doesn't work as efficient as you know, approaching Interpol as a single international organization that can reach out to any of its uh, 190 member countries and, and bother the police uh, located there and task them with certain duties that they have to do. Um, and the biggest difference uh, that I felt is uh, while being a part of this um, Interpol team, and I'm currently seconded and work full time from Interpol facility, is that I see the many processes going on uh, in the law enforcement organization. Um, and that helps uh, to understand and even uh, facilitate certain uh, investigation and certain procedures. So previously, um, when we worked with law enforcement in some of the cases, not, not necessarily uh, in all cases, but in some of the cases we communicated with law enforcement agency as with a black box. So actually it has an input and has an output. Uh, of our expectations. So input would be the data that we pass to the law enforcement, which includes command and control, uh, server IP addresses or domains, and we expect some actions by the law enforcement, such as takedown or you know, investigation or arrest uh, of the cyber criminal behind it. So very often we submitted some data and it was gone. Maybe because the processes got stuck and we could not actually help because this black box is, uh, is inaccessible for us. We cannot go in and fix anything. In Interpol, I'm a part of this black box and I can actually go and see what's wrong and perhaps just facilitate and help them to move on and to let the mechanism work. And in the end, we see a success, sto success story such as a SIMDA bot and takedown.